Please click on subscribe button and click on bell icon for more interesting updates on civil engineering concepts. In this video lecture, I will explain you how to import the ETAPS reinforcement results to the AutoCAD software. Okay, so this is also one of the most important concept in ETAPS software. So after modeling process and after designing process, just we have to import the typical floor plan reinforcement details for the respective slab section, beam sections, and column section to the AutoCAD software for printing purpose. Okay, so in this video, I will explain you how to import. The results from ETAP software to uh, AutoCAD software. Okay, so for that, firstly we have to select the ETAPS file. So here I am selecting my ETAPS 18 version software. Here you can see my software was open here like this. So initially we need to open the model. So go to File option, click on the Open option. So firstly I will select my desktop which is related to the folder and I am selecting IMP uh, file. Okay, so that the typical uh, model will be open which is related to the 2D structural model as well as 3D structural model for the building structure. Okay, so now you can see this is my 2D model and this is my 3D model for the structure. So initially I will show you the specifications for this respected building. So go to define option here, go to material properties. So this is the M25 grade concrete, HYSD 415 grade steel. Again in the same process I will show you the beam reinforcement section. Go to define option section properties which is related to the beam section. Just I was taken beam as 0.35 cross 0.23 and column is 0.35 cross 0.35. Okay. So after assigning all the load cases for the structure, just we have to do the analysis process. Go to click on the run analysis option. Okay. Uh, so actually I was done the analysis process for this respective structure. Though, so that's why it is not able to doing the analysis here. So after analysis process completed, just we have to click on the edit option. Okay. So before that we need to unlock the model here. Click on OK. So we have to add the strips for the slab. Go to edit. Just I am adding the strips. Go to click on the add strips option. So here I am selecting the floor which is related to the fourth floor. So again I am selecting the G1XA. I was already explained how to take the strips for the slab section in my previous video. You can follow that video. So after applying the strips for the fourth floor, again we have to apply the strips in Y direction condition. Just I am selecting Y here and B here. Click on apply option so that it will apply the strips in y direction condition also okay so after that we have to click on ok option again we have to do the analysis so go to click on the analysis option here for this respective structures so go to click on the analysis option here so that it will do the analysis process for the respective structure which is related to the four story building structure okay so it will take some time for the analysis of the structure so now we can see this is a deflection diagram after the analysis process now we have to design so go to concrete frame design. So firstly, we have to select the view revised preferences here. So you can select the IS codal provision. Again, click on the OK option. Go to click on the start design check option so that it will do the uh, start designing the beams columns for the respected frame section. So after that, we have to do the designing process for the slab section. So for that, we have to select this uh, slab design section. Go to click on the start design check option so that it will do the slab designing process for the building structure, which is related to the four story building. So after that, we have to save this model here. So here I'm saving my model. So before that, we need to check that uh, reinforcement values and this diagram for the structure. Okay. So after that, click on the close option so that it will close the ETAPS software. Now we have to open the detailing version. So here I'm selecting detailing CSI detailing, which is related to the 18. Okay. So in my previous videos, I was explained how to do the de detailing of the structure and how to uh, uh, import the structure from ETAPS software to and uh, CSI software. So please follow that video for clear understanding. So go to file option here. Click on the new detailing for importing process. So here I am selecting the desktop HSD. Click on the import option so that it will do the importing process for the respective structure. So initially it will open the structure in ETAPS 18 version software for the clarification of the model. So initially we need to check that model, model whether it is correct or not. So here my model is opening in ETAPS 18 version software. After model is opening, then it will be directly imported that uh, respective structure into uh, the ETAPS CSI detailing here. Okay. Now you can see detailing will be loading here like this, which is related to the grid stories, frames, joints, etc. Okay. So after loading process completed, it will directly close the ETAPS 18 version software. Now it is loaded with shells also. So after that, it will open the edit reinforcement sections option here like this, which is related to the slab beam column section. So firstly, we have to select the units option. So change the units force to kilo Newton. Click on OK. So here I'm selecting the preferences. Firstly, we have to select the use standard settings as per the Indian standard system. Click on OK. Concrete preferences you can select as per your consideration. So here I'm taking the beam layout is B. Again, I'm selecting the column. Just I'm taking the column layout is C. 
again i am taking the wall just i am taking the debl click on ok option so after that you can select the displacement preferences you can select as per your consideration rebar rules also you can select as per your consideration so here i am selecting uh, default values for this respected video click on ok but you can edit as per your consideration so click on ok option so that it will do the designing process detailing process for the respective structure by using etap software okay so after that it will show you the uh, frame plans and sections here like this so firstly we have to select the frame plan so this is my frame plan for this respected building structure again you can select the detailing for the respected structure also so now i am selecting the story so story number 1 why because i was consider the story number 1 for the designing section so here i am selecting floor framing plan so this is my floor play framing plan if you need this respected plan in autocad software you can easily import that uh, plan to the autocad okay so again i am selecting the reinforcement rebar plan here like this top and bar section so bottom reinforcement rebar bar section again all rebar bar section now you can see this is my all rebar bar section so now we have to export this respected uh, file into autocad software so for that firstly we have to select this export option export to view so in this you have to select the autocad 2000 the uh, 2000 plus drawing format otherwise you can easily select the dxf file format this is easy then uh, selecting the 2000 plus files okay so here we have to select the start export option so it will do the exporting process for this respective reinforcement so it is showing the message here as ready so that you can click on the okay option again in the same process you can select the beam detailing option here and concrete detailing framing plans so here i am selecting the concrete layout diagram so which is related to the center to center distance between the section so here i am selecting for one floor so click on the uh, export option so here you can change the name here just i am changing the name is a let us consider otherwise you can click on okay option so here i am selecting the start exporting option so that it will do the exporting process for the framing plan for the column section again in the same process we have to do the uh, column section sorry this is the beam section so go to select the column column reinforcing framing plan click on this pro option so this is the column center line diagram for this diagram okay so to export option click on the start this exporting option so that it will export the drawing here so after exporting process completed we need to see the diagrams in autocad software so for that select your res uh, respected folder so it will be consisting of your respected exported file here like this so initially i am selecting rebar plan for all stories levels okay so bar set the story level so that it will open the exported file from uh, csi detailing to autocad software so click on the z enter option a enter option so that it will load the file here like this so it will open the file which is related to the uh, reinforcement value diagram for the respective structure you can print this by using the layout option so you can click on the layout so that it will load the reinforcing diagram bars in the layout section okay so this is the process of uh, exporting the slab reinforcement details again in the same process we can see the results which is related to the beam uh, framing plans which is related to the center line diagram for the beam sections and column section just i am selecting the beam layout diagram here so it is asking to read only option click on s option so click on the z enter option a enter option so that it will load the uh, framing plan for this respected beam section here like this again in the same process you can save this file by using layout option so you can directly save from here again in the same process i will show you the column detailing uh, framing plan so click on the concrete column layout for the base which is related to the elevation section of 0 so again click on the s option so this respected values will be only read only so click on z enter option a enter option so that it will load the center line diagram for the respected beam okay so this is the complete process of exporting uh, csi detailing into the autocad software if you have any queries about this respected video please text me your questions in the below comment box i will try to give the answer for that respected questions thank you